Well, I'm going to be sharing the story uh, today with you of a harp that was customized that I think really it, it turned out to be fantastic for some really weird reasons. Um, the instrument that we're talking about is the uh, Honer Ace 48 Performance. And um, the harp has been uh, customized with a ergo button that's more comfortable at all angles. Uh, and then it, you can see how buttery smooth it is. It's been smoothed. And it was also air tightened. And while the comb was sanded at factory, it was clear. It was not sanded flat. I, I don't understand how that happened. But I did go ahead and just flatten the components and lap them, you know, the um, top of the flat blank to the slide to the lower part of the mouthpiece so that everything was, you know, fit perfectly for the slide. And again, just a beautiful running slide. And then, of course, uh, I made the uh, Kettlewell Frictionless uh, you know, mouthpiece slider, which provides uh, easy movement to new note hole positions, and you don't use saliva anymore to lubricate your harp. And uh, it also, the single hole model provides me a relaxed embouchure. I don't want to be doing that all the time. So I did these uh, customizations, and my initial tests with the harp, um, I found the tone lacking. And the way that Honer designed this was they put those brass insert things here, these things, brass inserts, into the back of the harmonica. And um, I, don't, I don't think they have any positive effect at all. That's my opinion. And um, <clears throat> I said to myself, and I called the owner, and I said, it is a resonant chamber back here that's quite large. And I said, there's a chance that with the back of the harmonica off, you know, this plastic slide on back, if that's off and the brass things aren't in it, it might actually have a, a better tone. And of course, um, because they did put the things in the center of the back here, the actual space for the comb chambers is smaller. So that didn't help much on the resonance. But this harp ended up with an absolutely great tone and I really, I really like it, and uh, I wanted to play it for you, and then I'm going to play it up against a very expensive custom harp. It's a Suzuki Fabulous that has a, a Honer 280C cover set from 22 years ago, and uh, it's a very fine instrument, very expensive. But, you know, you can see how good this one is. I love the, the feel of this harp uh, in the hand. And if you want a standard review, you know, go, there, there are reviews of this harp by other players, but I'm showing you some customization stuff that made a big difference. So we're going to be playing with Avi Maria, Yo-Yo Ma, and Catherine Stott on piano. Let's just have a little fun here.
it's very pleasing and it's something I can shape the sound a lot with my hands. So I'd say this is a hot and a fun harp. Let's compare it with this uh, high, high grade uh, Suzuki Fabulous. As you know, one of the more pricey harps on the market. I don't expect a harp in this price range, really, to compete with one in this price range because this is five times or more as expensive as this. That's not the point. The point is that I think the Honer is really good. And it responded to an unusual customization some of the things I especially like about this harper, I think it's got one of the most beautifully shaped mouthpieces. These edges are all smoothed. It's a lovely shape. It is trapezoidal, but the angles here are very smooth, and I really like that. I think the feel in the hand is marvelous of the covers. These are stainless covers. Of course, brass reeds. Um, but anyhow, uh, again, by removing the brass inserts, which requires no surgery, and leaving this back cover plate off, the whole heart become a resonance chamber and greatly improved the sound. Now I did not put the, the brass inserts in, I'm, I didn't want to put them in and take them out, but you can listen to other people who made videos to see what it's like with the brass things. But uh, I think as a customized instrument it's great. Uh, we don't have any of these available worldwide right now through uh, Dibel, who represents my harps around the world. But uh, you can have him get one, and I will customize it just like this for you. And you'd go to mastersofharmonica.com to see all the different customized harps uh, that I've created. And that's all Dibold does in the harmonica world, really, is to represent my harps. And uh, the only things that we offer are fully customized instruments, nothing stock, just everything that's tweaked out, uh, top pro level. But I, I would say, you know, I, I'm pleased with this Honer uh, Ace uh, 48 performance and I kind of like to have one. I think they're super cool and I know the owner will be very pleased.